This is a Poke Press Special Report. Hi, I'm Stephen Reich at the La Crosse area Days Inn in La Crosse, Wisconsin, at the Pokemon Trading Card Game, Wisconsin State Championships 2012. I'm here with Dwayne Schoenberg, who is one of the participants in the Masters Division of today's tournament. And Dwayne, you played a deck that's commonly known as Zekrom Eels. So first of all, uh, what are the, what's the balance on Zekroms that you use in that deck? Now one thing that some people may not know is that because Zekrom and Zekrom EX, the cards have different names, you could use in theory a maximum of four of each. What was the specific uh, blend that you used there? Well, I personally play a 3-2 line, some people play 2-2, two, two, or somebody just one Zekrom. Um, I didn't think the one Zekrom was consistent enough. I would, wouldn't draw into it when I needed it, and when I didn't need it, that's when I would draw into it. And uh, I just said, hey, I'm going to play a second Zekrom, and EX worked out for me today, fine. Came down to one prize, one prize to get me to top 16, but... All right, and then the next thing in the deck is um, you've, you've got a, a fair amount of energy since it is a lightning deck. Uh, besides the lightning energy, what else do you use? Anything? Um, I play doubles because people like to catch up your electrics, especially in against Durant. I mean, they'd catch up your electrics hoping you wouldn't run to a switch or doubles. So I play four doubles for that specific reason, and it works with Zekrom quite well. Because when it does 150, instead of discarding two electrics, you can just discard a double colorless. And next turn, either attach another one or attach another electric to hit for 50 or 80, depending on if you get heads on coin flip. And then what are some of the supporting cards? I mean, you've got some of the usuals, the uh, collectors, but what are some of the other trainers and supporters you're playing in this deck? Well, I played Level Ball instead of Pokecom because... I didn't, because I play mostly basics and I can get them out with my collectors, my, because I played four collector. And I'm like, I'm level ball just gets out the elect, the electrics and all that, other, and uh, you got dynamos when you need them, or anything in the deck but the Zekrom and the Zekrom EX and my Zapdos tech I played. But uh, also played, I didn't play any Evo Light because I didn't think the deck needed it, because you're going to get one shot and they're going to one shot you. Um. I played Terrakians, and then I played Prism Energies instead of Fighting Energies, because Prism Energies have dual use instead of uh, just a Fighting Energy, only being able to use mostly with Terrakian. All right, so what worked well for the deck today? What were in the, in the games you you, you won? Uh, what worked well in the deck? Well, almost every game, uh, except for one instance, uh, I got a, at least one turn two eel, which is almost ideal two would be perfect um but every deck has its downsides sometimes sometimes it's just the energy clogs your hand and you have no way to get it out and you mentioned that you've had some uh some issues too uh what were some of the the stumbling blocks you might have run into today and how might you rebalance the deck to try to uh accommodate those well um i didn't play a mewtwo personally because I couldn't get a Mewtwo, so I got a Mewtwo at the tournament today. So I'm going to be playing that instead of uh, instead of a third Terrac uh, instead of a third Terrakian. Um, but uh, otherwise, it it ran pretty good. What I could use is maybe cut down on some of the like uh, I add Pokey Gears so I can draw into my supporters like my Ponts more consistently, so I can get rid of those sometimes energy clogged hands that seem to plague me. All right. Thank you very much, Dwayne. This has been Stephen Reich at the Days Inn in La Crosse, Wisconsin, at the Pokemon Trading Card Game, Wisconsin State Championships 2012. This has been a PokePress Special Report.